Hey. Hi, everybody. Um, I've been thinking a lot about why uh, do I make these videos? Why do I bother trying to tell the world that I was a human being, that I was a person, that I had some rights, that they were violated, that I've been tortured, that this kind of treatment of human beings in a quote-unquote civilized world is unconscionable, satanic, evil, or just plain old wrong. Uh, perhaps it's the desperate desire to say, I exist, I exist, I exist, if even for a moment, you know? Uh, the thing about this is, in the digital realm, I exist only insofar as you can Google me, only insofar as YouTube will host my video bandwidth, only insofar as the search results contain my name, or you remember me, or the computer doesn't just delete it, or change the information inside of it to make it more fitting. I don't know. You know, I saw this uh, poster today. It said, uh, when the dreamer dies, what happens to the dream? You know, I've been thinking about death so much because that's what this is doing to me. This treatment, whatever it is, whatever it was, is killing me. And that sucks. The other thing that really frustrates me, because I consider myself somewhat intelligent, is that I have very little, almost no opportunity for actual, concrete, scientific evidence of what is happening to me. All I have is I can look in the mirror and see that, you know, my face has lost all of its collagen, and that my skin is turning color brown mottled specks and that my hair is falling out and that my bones are sticking in and my teeth are starting to fall out and uh, I have sores in my nose that won't heal but I don't have HIV I've been tested over and over uh, I do however have hepatitis C which along with the stress of what they're doing is gonna probably kill me too um, a lot of the symptoms I have, excuse me, are like post-traumatic stress symptoms from the physical violence, the emotional turmoil, the years of LSD and electroshock and irradiation and implantation and electromagnetic weapons and torture and, uh, you know, being felt, uh, being made to feel like like I'm less than human, like I don't deserve to live, like uh, there may not be a god, that my life is cheap. Um, and these are all things that the New World Order wants us to believe. Um, now whether this thing has anything to do with the New World Order or not, it doesn't really matter because it's the same thing. A police state where the police can know what you're thinking before you even realize you've thought it and take action preemptively based on your genetics before you're even born well you're gonna have a, a possible criminal tendency so we're gonna abort you I mean this is what we're talking about here these technologies are here now the singularity is fast approaching and for those of you who do not know what the singularity is the singularity refers to, uh, among other things, the point in time where artificial intelligence running on supercomputers of whatever nature, quantum computers, you know, whatever, uh, becomes smart enough to build a smarter artificial intelligence, one that is smarter than itself, and of course, one that is smarter than we as human beings could ever build. At that point, humans become rapidly unnecessary to the artificial intelligence. And I know this all sounds like gobbledygook fiction and da 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 da, but you know, real scientists have thought about this stuff. We've asked the artificial intelligences and they uh, have had a lot to say about it, so.
anyway. Yeah, I guess I'll just keep making these videos to show people that, uh, you know, I was a person, a human being just like them. And I'll have to show the deterioration and the sickness and the suffering and the moaning and the puking and all that stuff. So the world can see just what's happening. And those of you who want to believe, please do. Those of you who don't believe me, do your own research. It is sad to say that although I knew and understand about this type of thing ever since I was a small child, electromagnetic weapons, you know, covert operations, counterintelligence, counterinsurgency, uh, subliminal messaging, ELF, you know, etc., etc. It's one of these things where you go, oh yeah, the New World Order, yeah, I heard about that, I read about that, it's supposed to be really horrible, but as long as it doesn't affect me, I won't have to worry about it, you know?